Let's go. Ooh. Cheated me. Excuse me, I'm looking for Marabella. I am she. Wait outside, class is in session. Sorry, can't wait. Hear about Dandelion. I'm Geralt, and I'm... Geralt? I know you. Fine. If you're eager to join in the lesson, you're welcome to. Children, sadly the rat catcher has a fever today, but in his stead, we're honored to welcome a witcher, who will now tell us about his trade. Ah, uh, but... Yeah! This is grand! You shan't disappoint them, will you? So, who would like to ask the first question? Me! What's it mean that witches are lecturers? You shouldn't listen to everything people say about... Means they go to sleep early. Oh! So that's why Mum went to tuck that witcher in. Children, what's the meaning of this? Next question. Is it true witches kill kings? A man cursed, who's turned into a monster, a witcher might have to kill, even if he's a king. So King Fortest was a monster. What's it like to cut off someone's head? Can you show us how to cut off a head? Can we try your potions? Enough. That is all for today. Gather your things and I shall see you in the morning. Hear that! Bid farewell to Master Geralt. It's great you came. Mm, I'd have rather had the rat catcher. So please do tell me, why are you here? I know you saw Dandelion recently. Oh yes. Longest afternoon of my life. He read you his poems? No. He perused the illustrated guide to fungi. Hmm. Maybe... No. Won't even try to guess why he wanted to do that. Mold. That was his interest. When his hand abandoned my knee to point at a figure of penicillium, I knew the fire between us had died. Permanently. See Dandelion after the fungus incident? No. I even considered granting him another chance. His heart of hearts is pure gold. He simply needs a bit more discipline in his life. But he never came back to see me. So I thought if it's done, it's done. Thanks for your help. Farewell. I've had enough of you. 
this Baronet's love of Let's Villa. Shouldn't interest you. The Baroness don't mingle with just anyone. Don't worry. I'm here to see your chambermaid, Molly. Out of the way. Baroness is riding now. Be gone. Greetings, Witcher. Must admit it's curious to see you here. I don't quite believe in coincidences. Geralt of Rivia, slayer of monsters, and my son. You're right, General. My visit's no accident. I'm looking for someone. There's no one here who wishes to see you. Captain, this man is not to enter. Forgive me, Morvran, but I've lost my appetite for the races. Kill a woman's son and appear at her doorstep. My, my. I thought witches had better survival skills than that. Looking for a girl named Molly. Heard she works here. I fear your information's out of date. Molly no longer works here. Baroness fired her. Quite the contrary. Molly decided she no longer wished to serve. After Arian's demise, Luis's nephew came to pay his respects. But one clance of Molly and, well, they wed soon after. They now await his inheritance. With the Paroness's son dead, the estate will go to the nephew and Lady Lata, known until recently simply as Molly. I gotta wonder if Molly fell for the nephew or his inheritance. We cannot know that just yet. But either way, she has strong feelings for both. Alright, so where will I find the newly minted Lady Latar? Our dear little Molly has a new passion, horse racing. To my knowledge, she should be at Countess Vagelbud's villa right now. That's exactly where I'm going. Since you stripped me of Louise's company, perhaps you'd agree to come along. On our way, then. I must say, of all the creatures in this region, I find steeds most intriguing. Horses interest you at all, Witcher? All the same to me. Call each one I ride Roach. Strange. 